Today we are taking a look at a quick trick that will allow you to record audio when you're flying a drone. And you can record that audio directly to your DJI RC controller. Now this is great as it means you won't need an additional audio recorder to record that audio. What you're hearing right now is sound coming from a wireless microphone attached to my jacket. And the receiver is attached to the controller. Now that audio is being recorded directly onto a screen recording off that controller. Now this is really good because it means you can do things like record yourself talking to the drone and basically use the drone as an additional cameraman. It's if you have someone else there filming you. You could also use it to record audio notes or voice annotations over a screen recording if you're doing things like inspections or you could just use it to record ambient sounds such as the trees rustling or maybe waves you can then add over the top of your drone's camera video after the fact to make your videos much more engaging. So let's take a look at how you can set all this up. Let's jump right in. Now, as you may know, there is no microphone built into the DJI Mini 3 Pro, which is the drone we're going to be using for today's demonstration. But something you can do, and not a lot of people know, is you can record audio directly onto the DJI RC controller. So if you have a drone which uses the DJI RC controller, you will be able to use this method. Now this will work with any microphone which has a USB-C connection. I've actually tested this with other microphones, but the microphone that I keep coming back to is the DJI mic just because the sound quality is so good. So once you have your USB-C microphone, you will also need to make sure that you have a micro SD card inserted into the controller. Now the micro SD card inserts in the flap on the bottom of the DJI RC controller and the reason you need a micro SD card is because the audio will be stored to a screen recording. Very important to remember that the audio is getting stored to a screen recording and the screen recordings get stored to that micro SD card inserted into the controller. So if you don't have one in the controller you won't be able to do this so make sure that you pop a micro SD card into the controller. Now next to where you insert the micro SD card you will see a USB-C connection. Now this is where you plug in your microphone or the receiver unit if you're using a wireless microphone such as the DJI mic system. It's very important that you connect it to the USB-C connection that's under the flap and not the USB-C connection that you use for charging, the one that's outside of the flap. The next thing you want to do is attach the wireless transmitter microphone to yourself if you're using a wireless system and make sure that it's turned on. Now with the controller turned on, you might have had the controller turned on already, what you want to look for when you swipe down on the top right of the screen is a little headset icon. Now if you see this headset icon, you will know that your microphone has been recognized by the controller and you're good to go. The last thing you need to do is again swipe down on the top right of the screen and start a screen recording. And then the controller will be recording not only the screen, but the audio coming from your microphone. And then if you want to record the high quality video that doesn't have the interface on it from your drone, you can start a video recording at the same time. So as mentioned, the audio gets stored to a screen recording. And if you're just looking for audio over the top of a screen recording, if you're doing things like making audio notes when doing inspections, for example, then you will be good to go. But what if you want to record yourself talking as the drone is recording you using that high quality video coming from the drone? Well, to do this, you will need to match up the audio from the screen recording to the drone's video. And to do this, you need what's called a sync point. Now, a sync point is a large audio spike that you can add to your drone's screen recording so that you can match the audio up with a visual indicator on the high quality video coming from the drone's camera itself. Now there's two ways I usually do this. The first is I will swipe down in the top right of the controller screen, start a screen recording, and then I will press record and start the video recording from the drone's camera itself. And then just before takeoff, I will hold the drone up like this so it can see my hand and click my fingers. And this will create that large audio spike and also have a visual reference on the drone's video itself that I can line up and then I'll take the drone off. The other way you can do this is with the drone in the air to simply clap your hands together. And again, this will create an audio spike on your microphone and add a visual reference to your video. Then all you need to do is add your drone screen recording and the drone's camera recording to your video editor and line that spike up so that it lines up with either that clicking motion or that clapping motion. And then you'll know that audio is perfectly lined up to the drone's video. 
and you can simply remove the screen recording and just use the high quality video from your drone along with the audio that was stored on the controller screen recording. Now, if you've liked this video and you've learned something new, please let me know by giving me the thumbs up and clicking that like button down below. And if you love all things drones and want to know how to get more cinematic videos and better images with your drone, then I recommend you check out my channel where I have a ton of other content to help you level up your drone game. If you don't want to miss any of my upcoming videos, please remember to subscribe and make sure that notification bell's on so you will be alerted when my new videos come out. It would be greatly appreciated. And if you want to stick around and see a few more videos now, here's a few I personally recommend. I'll not keep you back any further. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you over there.